Look, I get it. They snap a picture of you, you look at yourself in the mirror, you just don't like what you're seeing in the mirror. It's completely understandable, but what I'm here to tell you is two things. One, you're in your head, I'm about to explain that in the video, and two, you're not alone. Everybody's thinking the same thing. When they see themselves in pictures and mirrors, you absolutely hate what you see. Let me show you. You're a stud, right? Everybody sees it except you because you will always be more negative than everybody else. The harsh truth is that nobody's gonna judge you as hard as you judge yourself. In the real world, everybody's filled with their own problems, their own things to do, and their own insecurities, so much so that they don't have time in their head to be judging every single person on the street. And those that they do end up judging, they end up judging so less strictly than they do on themselves because everybody's similar on judging themselves harshly over judging other people. Which takes us on to number two. The reason you hate what you look at is because you might be asymmetrical. And it's called the golden ratio. And this was discovered a long time ago, but our brain just loves symmetry, right? Balance and life. This is why there's so many satisfying videos when things fit perfectly in. Our brain just is pleased when we see symmetrical objects. Well, there's no difference when it comes to your face. If you draw a line down your face, all of us, including myself, we will have asymmetries where there's slight variances and differences. This is normal. This is why you don't like what you see. The cool part is that you can do things to make a difference. For example, throwing on glasses. This is one of the easiest ways to add that symmetry to your face. See, a glass is a symmetrical object that's perfectly balanced. When you throw it onto your face, it gives the illusion that your face is equally perfectly balanced, making you look more symmetrical and more attractive. On top of, sunglasses also hide imperfections. So if you have any asymmetries in your eyes or your eyebrows or your cheekbones, you throw on glasses, those imperfections are now hid and you look more attractive. So now when you snap a picture or you look at yourself in the mirror, you look like a stud, especially if you picked up a pair of Jade Blacks. Boys, RJ Blacks, we just dropped 11 new designs. These are top tier. These are some of my favorite designs that we have dropped. We were, so, just so you understand something, we were supposed to drop this, uh, I think it was almost six months ago. And because of shipping delays and everything that's going on around in the supply chain, we haven't been able to launch it until now. Boys, if I were you, I'd go pick up a pair. I've been sold out with Jade Black now for almost five months in all popular designs. We just restocked popular designs, plus brought in these 11 new designs. If I were you, I'd go pick. Bro, we start at 49 bucks. We're using Mazu Kelly Italian acetate, which is the same acetate that high-end $300, $400 frames are using. Ours are only 49 bucks. If I were you, I'd pick up two, three, four pairs, and it's still cheaper than just one pair of designer frames. If you guys wanna check out Jade Black, boys, it's gonna be linked down below. Number three, you're not investing in yourself enough. Time, clothing, grooming, effort, these are all things that you have to invest into yourself and this is just gonna increase your internal perception of yourself because it's gonna increase how much you're actually appreciating yourself, appreciating your health and your well-being. See, the more you go to the gym, the more you take care of your health and what you're eating and how you take care of your skin, the more you're gonna like what you see in the mirror and pictures because you know the effort it took to build this version of yourself. The more you invest in yourself, the more you'll appreciate yourself. Which rolls us on to number four, loss aversion. Our brain is triggered to not like losses. Most of the time when you see yourself in the mirror or in a picture, you will focus on every single detail that you hate about yourself, ignoring all the positive stuff that you actually like. And this is because, like I said, because of that phenomenon called loss aversion where your brain hates the idea of a loss or something negative. So now you will over magnify your negatives or minimalize your positives and in your head, now you perceive that you are uglier than what you really think you are. Which rolls us on to number five. You're not showing your good side. See, I've showed it before, not by myself, but also with science, that scientifically, your good side is your left side. This is, this is true for almost everybody, mainly because the right side of our brain controls the muscle function from the left side of our body. And since the right side controls emotions, this is why with our left side, we're able to express more emotions and have more facial control on the left side, making the left side more attractive than the right side. Finally, number six, you just look goofy. See, anytime you look at yourself in the mirror or people snap a picture, you just look goofy, all hunched over. You're not looking into the camera. You look like you just don't even wanna be there. This is mainly because your posture is just jacked up. So instead of looking like the hunchback of Notre Dame every time they snap a picture, I always want you to look good. I want you to feel confident. So when they snap that picture, you just look good. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget 
to check out Jade Black and our new design glasses. If you guys want to check those out, they'll be linked down below as well. That's it for me today. See you next time.